<clears throat> this morning, in honor of Veterans Day, I'm a veteran, we are heading up to the Blue Ridge Mountains in the Shenandoah Valley of Virginia for a little bit of R&R. &R. Okay. Money check, cell phone check, red bag check. Alright, checklist is complete. Looks like we're good to go. I have to use a checklist for everything. If I don't, I'll get something important. I already forgot one thing very important. What? One must look cool. First stop today is going to be what's the name of the brewery? Devil's Backbone. Devil's Backbone Brewery. Stop and have some lunch. Uh, this is right outside of Charlottesville, Virginia. And you know, just thinking, when I met Miriam, say hi, Miriam. She was a red wine drinker. White wine. White wine drinker. And now I've got her drinking tequila. I've got her drinking beer. I have ruined a perfectly good woman. <sighs> Surprise your daddy hasn't killed me. Base Camp Brew Pub and Meadows. Oh yeah, we can spend a happy afternoon here, John. Okay. What are you thinking about for lunch? You know, it's not like it's oh, it's 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 it's
and to cut the expense for your lodging. We have basically rented a room in a private residence with a, with a private entrance in a residential area, this small town, and I'm going to show it to you. It's real cool. So, here we are. Oh, I got the cheese. I got the cheese? Okay, room comes with a uh, little sink area, microwave, refrigerator, coffee pot, water pot, uh, the sleeping area, nice comfy bed, very spacious, little seating area, and uh, the bathroom with shower, and all the uh, comforts of home with a nice skylight. Uh, it's very, very cozy. It's, uh, um, if you have not uh, explored or taken advantage of the concept of Airbnb and you love traveling, you got to do it. It's, uh, this is our, how many, how many times have we done this now? Number five. Number five, and they've all been really good. We're up on the uh, Blue Ridge Parkway, uh, coming up on Afton Mountain, traveling this part of the state, enjoying the wilderness. Gosh, when I was in my late teens, early 20s, I've, I've camped up in this area a lot, backpacked and just car camp. And the parkway is, I don't know, it's always sort of like been a long, an old friend. It's, uh, it's always been a, a sanctuary for me. One of my fondest memories of coming up to the parkway. Uh, I was up here on a solo trip in the summertime. It was nighttime. And I was listening to a distant AM radio station. And there's also a thunderstorm. And the Blue Ridge Parkway, if you can tell, we're actually up on sort of a ridge top, which follows the Blue Ridge Parkway sort of follows the ridge line. So I was up in the thunderstorm, listening to the radio station having a snack and it was uh, one of the most memorable traveling experiences that I, I can recall it was it was surreal to be driving through the mountains through a thunderstorm just it's hard to describe what was your favorite part of the weekend the driving. I'm a sucker for road trips, uh, going through the mountains, uh, back roads I've never been on before, hitting small spaces. Um, anytime I can get up here to the mountains, especially the Blue Ridge Parkway. Yeah. How about you? I think the best part of the drive yesterday was the country roads when we got off the, the parkway and went, went out on some roads we hadn't traveled before. And I just love the, um, the rolling, the rolling green farmland and and the, the moon was pretty yesterday afternoon just a three-day weekend getaway um, they're great especially when you just get up here to the mountains and just kind of hang out that was our plan for this trip uh, yeah, it's just it was nice to see um, how other communities uh, just, just to get a feel for a different community um, yeah that uh, the place we stayed Dayton is um, uh, very much a small town and very heavy uh, Mennonite influence and ran into the old building that was the um, Conservatory of Music back in the 20s. And mm -hmm. It was kind of cool. Yeah, our diet has been horrendous. Anytime we travel, we uh, I always we try to plan as much as you can uh, what to eat, how to eat, but you always end up eating at restaurants or eating stuff that's not good. Just eating too much and too often, especially when you're sitting most of the time in a car. The best meals were um, that little mom and pop restaurant that reminded us of our grandmother's cooking yes. Friday night. Where the waitresses still call you a hun and the cooks actually cook. <laughs> and breakfast this morning where the uh, the table next to us, we, we were old buddies by the time we finished our breakfast. By the way, where we're at right now is uh, about mile marker 12 on the Blue Ridge Parkway near uh, uh, Charlottesville and Waynesboro area of Virginia. Uh, the Blue Ridge Parkway, the Skyline Drive intersect it uh, a little further up the road along with US 250 and Interstate 64. So this is easy from our home, it's three and a half hour drive from here.
<laughs> yep, it's been enjoyable. Well, that's going to pretty much conclude the video for this trip. Uh, so, uh, uh, well, the journey will continue. Yep, absolutely.